Civilization is a vulnerable thing, a whim of circumstance. At any time, the smallest flap of a butterfly's wings may set catastrophe in motion. Haran, an entire city wiped from the map. Those left behind there did not stand a chance. The world's greatest minds came together and found a vaccine against the Haran virus. Finally, mankind had prevailed against the disease. But people always want more. Despite a promise to shutter its labs, the GRE continued its research in secrecy for military purposes. It didn't take long for a variant of THV to escape into the world once more. The fall happened more rapidly than anyone could have predicted. The few who survived now live in small enclaves, the only means of contact between distant human settlements are lone individuals, brave or desperate enough to travel on their own across dangerous wastelands. They are known as pilgrims. Somewhere on the map, one city is still standing. A city isolated from the outside world. A city with special rules. Now, it's the last bastion of humanity. A chance for us to learn from history. And for once, make the right choices. Because every choice you make here shapes the future. Irreversibly. Hey everyone, I'm Dulag and welcome in the first episode of Dying Light 2. Finally, the game came out and we can play it. I'm so actually excited. After waiting so long, the time has come. So, I don't know what, what, what to say, to be honest. I mean, I tested the game before and it looks amazing. The music is insane and... and um, the parkour, I mean, you just have to get used to it, you know? Um, so, yeah, without further ado, let's get started. Twenty thirty six. Oh, so we are in the future actually. Fifteen years after the fall. Um, you mean fifteen years after the Dying Light One? Maybe. Here's the guy, Aiden. Okay, I guess he's running away. Yeah. Oh shit, that was close. Oh, just don't fall, my guy. I'll be good. <laughs> okay, nice. Oh, that was close. I didn't do anything, but. You still got it. Wait, <laughs> well, Spike is here. <laughs> what? Okay, man. 
because of slow pilgrim. Yeah, a, a dead, dead pilgrim. pilgrim. Yeah, I know, I know. Get up here. I want to show you something. So as you can see, um, this this game looks incredibly good. Like, it's just wow. I don't know what to say. There we go. We have stamina bar. So it's not like in, in Dying Light 1 where you can just, you know, climb forever. Um, And I realized there is no sprint button actually. So you don't have to press shift. As long as you play on PC, of course. But, Shit, man. Uh, You're still strong. Yeah, so we are not losing stamina by sprinting, if I can actually call it. Uh, but we are losing stamina Thanks. when we are climbing. It's good to see you, Spike. That's for sure. How long has it been? Far too long. But don't get all mushy on me now. Oh, he changed Come. so much. I want to show you something. Wow. Where are we going? You'll see. It's incredible. So that that's Quite the incredible. normal speed. Even if I press shift, then nothing two, happens. Oh, you've been kicking around for what? Four years now? And you're still alive. So are you. Or some zombies. I know, but I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right, right. Seriously. I wish I had as much energy as you. I mean, Got he's old, right? Jane? Nah, trail went cold after New Paris. Which route did you take? Through Baines or Gary? Eh, Baines. What a shithole. Some five rickety huts <laughs> left and a ramshackle fence. Okay, so what now? Look at that. A beehive full of honey. Can't let an opportunity like this go to waste. Uh, no way. Oh, look around. If we're lucky, there's chamomile growing here too. Okay. So what now? Call the canyon. Chamomile. If that's actually correct. Okay. So there's one. And that's pretty cool, actually. Holy shit. The survival sense is way different than... In um, Dang Light 1. I mean, different yeah, and better. That's for sure. So, even though I have to collect only two, I'm actually gonna collect a little bit more. I don't know if I need it, but maybe I'm gonna need it. No idea. Do you remember that old herbalist we helped escort to her village? Oh, yeah, the one that had that saying uh, Remember, chamomile and honey are gifts that keep giving. Combine them and lucky you, you just might go on living. <laughs> it's really cool that, that he's actually in Dying Light too. I mean... Press I? Okay. You received your first blueprint. Okay. So by pressing E, there's inventory. The craft parts. And that's actually cool. It it's also different than in in the Ignite one. Before, if you wanted to crowd like multiple med kits, then you would have to like just press craft and then wait and then press again. Now you can just either hold your uh, left mouse button or just press C and craft as much as you want. So, or maybe as much as you can, but Come on, you know what I mean. Almost there. So that's really cool. Okay, so where we are going now? It's probably the the building from the from the gameplay. Yeah. There are zombies. I can hear it. This is it. Come on. Ooh, he has some strength. Oh that was smooth, actually. So yeah, um, I'm I'm really excited to <laughs> play Dying Life finally. Oh my god! Damn it! Can you open it? I'll try to get through here. You check the oh, outside. Oh yeah, like Take like always, like use. always. Yeah, sure. Uh, there's nothing. All right. Probably have to go through here. Yeah. Okay. There's no other way. Press C to crouch, yep. Oh, you can see? It marks the... It highlighted the, the items. That's pretty cool. Can we get a map? 
Never mind. <laughs> There's nothing. Nothing here. Nothing here? What is that building? There's nothing. Okay, what is it? Next to mine. Five years later. Okay. Newspaper article, October 11th, 2020. Hey, there we go. Party. Uh, but by then the GRE would have long since lost control of the virus. Yeah, true. Can I open it? It's not. Nope. Okay, so we have to look further. Zombie? Just a mouse. Hey, everything all right? Yeah, just rats. I think it's time we parted ways. No oh, rats, no mouse. Why? Whatever. I'm starting to worry about you, and you know what I'm saying. If you're starting to worry about someone, it means it's time to go. Yeah, he's right. Okay, so but let me get the items. Can I? Yep. What we can find here? Some rice, thank you. Resin, some drink. Do we have a flashlight? Nope, we don't. That sucks, but it's fine. Nothing in here. In here. Anything else? There's something. Oh, that's also cool. Sometimes, if the rarity is above common, you have to alt. I have to actually search it. I don't know why, but oh well. That's what the developers intended. Okay, what is that? I Alcohol. How the wine tasted back then. Okay, anything else? Guitar? I can play it. <laughs> Who do you voodoo? Hmm. Sounds familiar. It it sounds familiar. I think it's from Dying Light One, but I don't remember. When did I? And that's what they call that in, art. in the game. I mean, it's disgusting. Okay, so there's an item. Crabs, so probably to repair weapons. Oh, the casting. <laughs> okay, did that. Holy shit. What it says? Sorry, love. Goodbye. No, sorry, Dave. Sorry. My bad. That's heartbreaking. Ah. Uh, shit. There's nothing like a party to celebrate the end of the world. Uh, they died on their own terms. Let's hope we get that lucky too. <sighs> I'll see what's upstairs. You check out the garden, okay? Okay. Okay, but let me go back for a second. Because I missed some items here. There's something, there we go. Uh, there's something too. And I'm gonna show you something right now. If you crouch and you see that little icon hide area, you can actually go under. And zombies won't see you, most probably. I mean, if you use the flashlight or something, they can notice you, but... Most of the time they won't, so that's really cool. It's something actually new than in Dying Light 1, because you could, couldn't really hide. Okay, there's something else. Oh, there's something, yeah. Anything else? Let's have a look. Mm, nope. So let's check the garden. There's nothing. That was a pretty smooth move. Okay, then. There is something we Yep, we can investigate. No idea who is that. At least they had each other. Someone from DL1? 
Maybe. But I'm not sure, actually. Okay, what here? It's classy. <laughs> okay, and here? Something else? Oh, isn't that the Easter egg? The pictures are from the... Dearest Mary. Um, I'm sorry I ran from you. They say that once the virus makes you turn, second employees. you're gone forever. That can't be true. I know you're still in there, underneath all that pain and disease. I'm Don't coming to join you. you. No more, no more running. God. Hey, Goodbye, letter. Check this out. Probably. Wow. And can you hear the music? Like, holy shit, it's so good. Like, it... it that moment it fits perfect. It's way better than in, in Dying Light One. Can I go this way. Okay, okay. Go. Okay, what we can find here? Probably just talk to him. Yeah, I don't see anything else. All right. Sit down, buddy. For you. A gift? A gift from the heavens, to be more accurate. <laughs> I've just found it. By the owner's dead body. May it be of more use to you. Here. It's pretty chill. It's gone flat. <laughs> Look at you and your sophisticated palate. Drink. Who would have thought the end of the world could be so peaceful? Yeah, at least until night falls. True. I wish Crane could have seen this. Wh who? Doesn't matter. But don't tell me he's dead. I mean... Wow. I tracked down that guy for you. Okay, so... If you don't know, the... You, you have sometimes options when you're talking, so the wise one is the optional, so hey, what, what, it doesn't Quit progress the story. You became a pilgrim to track that so it's just, down. you know, more information. Someone who knows it. And now that's... Hey, what? And you're only telling me now? <laughs> when I tossed you a beer, thought you guessed right away we were celebrating. The guy's in Villador. Supposedly, he knows something about walls. Villador. So I'm that close, huh? Hey, I got a favor to ask you. You deliver this to Gary, it's on your way. People don't like pilgrims there, but, but they pay well. <laughs> and where do people like pilgrims? Well, they're afraid of us. Everyone does their best to survive. <laughs> Maybe. But when something needs to be transported through the hordes of infected, and suddenly, they're knocking on our doors. All right, but you owe me one. <laughs> Thanks, man. Uh, not just one. So, what about that guy? Well, I talked to him over the radio. He didn't tell me his name. Sounds like he's got something to hide. See that antenna on the hill? That'll help you contact the informant. He'll be listening for you at dawn on a frequency of 140.200 megahertz. Okay. Told totally him he'd hear from you soon. All right. Uh, you know what? I go straight to the city. I'll just go straight to the city. It's not that simple. Villador was supposed to be one of the zones. Cities that were walled off to keep out the plague. The plan fucked up. But this city and its walls survived. But this guy knows a way in. Get in touch with him, and he'll tell you everything. All right. Do you know what he wants in return? What does he want in return? Didn't say. But he didn't sound like the kind of guy who does things for free. I don't think that kind of guy exists. What? What about me? You're an old fart who likes uh -huh. racing me, and makes me ask around about his crazy girlfriend. Hey, hey, hey. She's not crazy. Jane's just maybe... Well, a little hot-headed. And she's always getting herself into trouble. 
but if you could get a load of her. It's almost like Jade. But <laughs> Whoa, all right. Still too early in it's the probably not the same person eyes. since I was going to say eyes. actually died. Beautiful. In DL1. Steely. Huge. Never heard anyone get so worked up about gray eyes. Because you don't know shit about the world, let alone women. Yeah, you're probably right. I'm telling you, I'll finally find Jane. We'll set up a house. We're going to live there. No one's going to drive us out. And I'll stop wondering like a moron. I'll drink to that. And that waltz. What's his deal? Is he family? No. Not at all. <laughs> then why are you looking for him? Will you tell me sometime? Yeah. Yeah, one day. Well, <sighs> my time's up. So when will I see you again, huh? In another two years? Maybe. Take care, man. I hope you find that waltz guy. Or whoever you're looking for. I just hope he doesn't remember, die in... in... 140.200 megahertz. At dawn, the guy's waiting for you. Okay, 1420. Simple. If I don't forget. <laughs> like always. Uh, alright. Go now? Uh, oh, this way. Okay. Get to the radio antenna. Uh... There are no craft parts from what I see. I think we can go straight here. This is the recording. One sec. Yep. Yes. That's fine. I think I've heard zombie. Hold tab to check the current. Oh, okay. So if I just forgot what my objective is, then I can just do this. Can I just jump like that? So I can. Okay. What if I jump? Oh, it's not like in DL1. Okay. So it's better not to do that. But I can really... I can swim fast. Oh well. Unlucky. Uh, oh. Biters. Hello. Bye bye. One is down. Gonna search. Yep. There's another one. There's another one. Oof. That stamina bar is going down pretty fast. But it's probably just because. It's um, the beginning of the game, so if I level up or something, then it should be better. Okay, what we can find here? There's no zombies. Oh, actually, I, did, <clears throat> I didn't told you. It's really cool. If there are zombies, like inside, outside, whatever. Um, if you use your survival sense, it will highlight them. So, that's actually pretty useful. I really like it. Is there anything else? Craft parts? Many of them. That's a lot. There's anything else? There's something, there's something. We got the weapon. Is it better? Let me compare them actually. Uh, it's worse, but we can keep it. So later we can sell it, I think. There are some mats. I mean, materials. There's something else. There's two. And here is... I guess that's it. Yeah. Now... Uh, do we have to climb? I guess so. Oh, wait. There we go. Okay, so what's here? Oh, there is a zombie. You see? He's highlighted. Did he draw? Oh. Okay. Uh, are there any materials? 
Probably not. Can I check? Yeah, there's nothing. Alright, let's move on. Uh, am I going the wrong way? There's nothing. Oh, here. Okay, I see. Here, then here. To the boss. Is there anything else? Probably not. This police car. Ah. Uh, no, there's nothing. Okay, we can move on. Oh, don't get too close to the boys or they will wake up. Can I just go like this? Does it matter? It's not. Oh, okay. I have to be careful to not be too loud. I see. Okay. Hey. The music changed again. Wow. We gotta climb up here. This way. Come on, jump. Okay. Okay. Can we go this way? Is there anything we can find? Probably not. Hmm. I go this way? Oh. Wait. Did I just skip? <laughs> I think I just skipped it. Oh, there. It's fine, it's fine. I think we are getting really close now. I think it's that building on the top. Might be. Okay, anything else? There's nothing, there's nothing. Zip line. Pretty cool. Okay. Wow, did this game just just look at this? I mean, oh no, okay, don't tell me. Oh no, I don't like it. I don't like it. If there is gonna be, okay, it was it was a letter K action. Is he gonna? Oh, he dies. <laughs> okay, not this way. Uh, oh, here, okay. Parkour skill, okay, it's you. You've leveled up your parkour profici proficiency and earned your first parkour skill point. You can now use it to unlock your first parkour skill. Sure, yeah. So what can I... Oh, only one. High jump allows you to reach higher ledges when you hold spacebar while jumping. Oh, okay. That's cool. What is this? Active landing. I was pretty high, actually. Reduce fall damage to keep your momentum. Press C just before the landing. Alright, and what is this? Trim grip. Make the last climb on ledges. Even when your stamina is gone and briefly maintain your grip when you land on ledges from great heights. That could be useful, right? but I think... The the roll would be even more useful than this. Almost there. Oh, he can jump so high! Holy shit! It's getting dark, actually. I think I hear zombies. Oh, it's already dark. It's time to hide. It is. For the night. It won't get any better than this. for a safe place but can I check this one what the? Oh. 
Ah, shit. Well, it's fine. It just biters, so it should. What the hell is that? I mean, good question. What the fuck? What? What? What is that? <laughs> I mean, it actually looks funny when when zombies jumping like that. Okay, combat basics. Um, some enemies use power attacks that deal massive damage and can knock you down. When an enemy is about to use a power attack, his health bar starts blinking red, just to avoid being hit. That should be easy, in theory. To perform a dash, press space bar while moving back or to a side. Alright, I'll try. Wait, he's not getting any damage now. What's he doing? Oh, shit. Ah, that was quick. I gotta be careful with my stamina because... It's not like in Dying Light 1 I don't have unlimited yet, at least. One. Okay. That was close. Ooh. Actually, that's really cool that we could already see a um the new type of a zombie. So yeah, I mean it's not like volatile, but it's it's cool. It's actually cool. Can I jump on this? I can. Oh wow! There is nothing, right? Yeah, there is nothing. Uh, can I open it, actually? Oh, I can. Nice. Let's spam the F. Quick. What we can find here? Registry chopper. Is it better? Probably not. Ah, nope. We can sell it. That's for sure. Okay, I can pick this up. Not this. Okay, it's working. So... What now? I know I can go inside. Can I close it? The broadcast station okay. should be here somewhere. Backpacks. Oh, let me search. Okay, I can open these doors. Uh, that's that's a cool music actually. Almost the same in like Dying Light One. Oh yeah, I mean it's cool. Ah, uh, okay. What is this? Okay, I I can escape this way. I think I don't know what does it mean actually. Some new crafting materials. Let's go. Fresh. Just nothing. All right. We're gonna go this way. A weapon. Cool. What's this? Someone moved them. Not long ago. Wait. What? It's been moved. Oh, okay. Okay. Let's give it a try. <laughs> It would be really cool if I could get a flashlight, because I can't really see much, but uh, it's fine. <gasps> oh, it's safe zone. You just unlock the first safe zone, increasing your network of respawn points. All safe zones are equipped with UV light with guaranteed safety at night. Additionally, each safe zone offers access to resting place, where you can change the day-night phase. An Aiden stash where you can leave your excess items. So, like, this is it. Broadcast station. Okay, so, we get some meds again. Oh, we can swap instead of. Okay, that's something new. Let's go. What do we have here actually? Can I try it? In fact, a trophy. Oh, okay. 
So we have some tabs here. Some goods, extra. Item across for the bundle. Oh, it's from the, yeah. It's the art book. Wait, oh, yeah. I have art book. That's cool. Reach the sky. Remember to always aim high with the reach. Can I use it? No. Declan GG. Ah, this is just some extra stuff. Right, so, wait, can I use it? Hey, let's roll. Okay, uh, I think it was 1420. This one, yeah. Right? Uh, this is Aiden, over. Anyone there looking for a pilgrim? Over. Or maybe not. I think I was I wrong. I have to wait until morning. Let's check the older one. Well, you know, I came all the way from Terzawa and looked. And there's a hole in the can. Had to go all the fucking way back. Okay, now this one. Getting lower. Charlie says a fox beat him. What fox? They've been extinct for over a decade. Probably some biter jumped him and he's talking crap. But his marker's glowing green. Well, he's already infected. What do you expect? Well, still, you keep an eye on him. Okay, not this one. He won't confide in me. Just make those speeches of his to the mirror. Ator will never be like the commander. Oh, that's pretty high, but it's gonna go lower a little bit. No man. If they just cuff crawl, they'd solve Lucas's murder real quick. This business with Lucas is fucked up, but you can't take your anger out on the bazaar. Oh, another one. A coming from one of those bazaar idiots. Well, I was surprised. And the last one. Probably. Have you seen Dennis today? Nope. Come to think of it, I haven't seen him for a couple of days. Why? He went to the old GRE containers to look for medicine. Told him it oh, GRE already, again. Oh my and that he's god. Suicidal. If he went alone, we might as well just dig him a grave. Oh, there's another one. Holy shit. Hey. Uh, enough of that. It was <laughs> time to sleep. I'll try again. <laughs> it was worth it actually. <laughs> oh, okay, let's go to sleep then. Hmm. All right. Aiden. Aiden, oh, he's streaming about the past. So many kids. What the fuck? Wait here. Nothing good will come of this. Have you brought twelve three? What are you doing with them? We were supposed to take the patients back to the city. Don't worry, they'll let us go soon. I'm scared. I'm here with you. You're safe with me. I know. Do what I tell you. 
what? Okay. Doing some kind of experiments? What the heck? Dr. Waltz, we won't make it. The military will be here any moment. Wait. Close your eyes. I guess I didn't want to revenge as well for what the Waltz guy did. a bad dream so what now uh, time to contact the guy spike was talking about okay so when I get once again uh 1420 right this is Aiden I'm on frequency 140.200 megahertz. Hello? Aiden? Yes. Hmm? I was someone. supposed to get in touch with you. I thought you'd change your mind. Why are you looking for Waltz, Pilgrim? To find someone else. Her name is Mia. Fifteen years ago, we were in a hospital together and... I know who you're looking for, Aiden. You want to know why Waltz was doing those experiments on all of you. Why you are stronger, more durable than others. Now, oh, so we are special. Me. I've been looking for her since I left the survivor's camp. I, can you help me or not? Maybe I can. Let's meet, Pilgrim. Where and when? Entrance to the metro tunnel by the bay. You can get inside the tunnels through an open GRE hatch. I'll meet you there. Okay then. I take it you're not doing this for free. I have to leave the city, but I won't make it on my own outside. Take me to New Paris, and we're even. Along the way, I'll tell you everything I know. Over and out. Wait. I have to at least know if she's alive. She's alive. I mean, I'm you're not gonna to trust him, right? I'll see you later, Rita. Wow. This game is already amazing. But yeah, um it's already 40 minutes long, so um we we'll see you in the next episode. So thank you all for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.